Memoirs from Beyond the Tomb by Chateaubriand. That is François René de Chateaubriand. Uh, this was, for those of you who don't know, a guy who lived in the time of the French Revolution and Napoleon afterwards. And he was in the thick of it. He lived in the United States for a while as well. And then he, he wrote these memoirs, but he, he ordered that they not be published until after he died. His idea was, here we see the original French writing. Uh, the idea was that he could say what he wanted to. He wouldn't offend anyone while he was alive. So this isn't a complete, the complete memoir. This was selected and translated by Robert Baldick. I should point out that it's in English. And it has a different illustrations throughout. So it's got these sort of pencil ones, which were found in his memoirs. And then it's also got selected you know, paintings and art from the time. That's actually his sister. So it's got these sections of illustrations that are in a few different places in the book. That's Russia. That's Napoleon in Russia. Uh, but then throughout, it's got those, those things, but then throughout it's got the occasional pencil sketch. I think I just passed one. Or maybe, is that the same one I looked at before? I'm not sure. I haven't read this book. I actually haven't read it in any form, let alone this particular form, this, this edition. So I'm really looking forward to it. This is obviously when he was in the United States. Very much looking forward to getting into this book. He was supposedly a brilliant writer and a brilliant observer of people around him. It's bound in this cloth. And uh, yeah, it has an introduction by Philip Mansell. Or Mansell, I don't know whether to go for the schwa there. All right, there we go. Memoirs from Beyond the Tomb by Chateaubriand, put out by the Folio Society.